All right, yo, we are at a university actually that I don't like very much because I attended Walsh University, but we're at Malone, and this is our final away match of the season. We're playing Ambassadors. It should be a good one, and it's a very important one for the Delaware Rising faithful as well, simply because we are in the playoff hunt. So essentially, we need to win out. If we do, we're in the playoffs. If not, there are certain different scenarios that can work itself out where we can still make the second place in the playoffs. But we'd rather just win out, so hopefully that will be the case. We will see. But I'm going to be vlogging today, and Dan the Man is running the stream. What a guy. Dan the Man, what is your prediction for today's game? I'm going to go with 2-1 in favor of us. 2-1. Let's leave nothing up to chance. Let's go. Exactly right. All right, Dan, good luck with the stream, and I will see you very soon. Rise on three. One, two, three. Rise. Rise. Well, you saw a penalty right there. Unfortunately, it was a tackle in the box after Tanner makes a lovely save one on one as a guy gets past our back line. But now that score line, now 1-0 in favor of Ambassadors. Not a great start. That's in like the third minute. It's all right, though. Get that out of our systems. Let's go, because this is an important game. We've got this, boys. Let's go. And just like that, the score is now 1-1. We're back. It's level off a lovely volley from your boy Morris and now if I am not mistaken he is now the leading goal scorer for the squad you'd love to see and hopefully uh, we get some more of those knocked in the net but this is a big game let's go so Alex score yeah. currently 1-1 what's the thoughts early in the game oh um, well we got to go to the left more got to go to Mason more because he's burning that guy over there. I'm not going to call out the defender, but we all know who he is. Attaboy. And uh, yeah. last thing, what's the final prediction after seeing the first Body said team? body! 3-1 uh, us. Beauty, baby, beauty. Yes, sir. Mr. Herman, are warming up. What are your thoughts on the game so far? Uh, we're playing really well. We're dominating possession. Still tied. Just hoping to get in and bring some more energy and get another goal. Get us in the lead. So you're about to go on. You're warming up. What are you mm -hmm. going to bring to the pitch? I'm hoping I can check in deep. I'm going to guess I'm going to go in at striker. So hopefully check in deep and keep the connection going and we can get in behind their defense and pop one in. Yes, sir, baby. Do it. Let's go. Love it. Well, the score. Now 2-1, Mason putting in number two for Delaware and for himself. What a goal scorer. We love him. So that makes the score, like I said, now 2-1. to one. We are up, so that is very important. As currently, playoff standings, Amish are, I believe, one point ahead of us, sitting in that second playoff spot. We want to be there. And again, like I said, if we win out, we win this game, and we play Amish, final game of the season, win that as well, we're a lock. Future is in our hands. Let's do it. It's looking good so far on the back of Mason Morris, my guy. Fam, the game is getting intense. So, Ambassadors had a good chance, good build up play into the box, got a little scrappy. Tanner makes a good save, and then a goal line clearance from Ryland, the coaching staff for Ambassadors, not happy. They thought it was a handball. I didn't see it. I thought it looked good. He just like threw his body at it. But they're not happy, so this game's getting, getting a little chippy, getting intense, as it should. Big ramifications on this game. Right. Yo, 
What a big save from Tanner Masters, keeping us in the lead 2-1. Penalty, unfortunately, against one of our players, it was pretty much a break for Ambassadors, but Tanner keeping us in the game, what a save. We have about 20 minutes remaining. The game is getting intense. It's still 2-1. We lead, but now it's getting chippy. And actually, there is a former Delaware Rising player on the squad and a player that came to trials but didn't make the cut. So, intense stuff. Come on, up the Rising, baby. Did I call the score? Did I? I think I said 2-1, didn't I? Yep, 2-1. Oh, damn. You okay. did, man. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> What's the vibe after that game? Oh, it's great. I love it. Right? Good win. Especially because I, somebody dropped in the chat that Amish County lost today. 2-1. Nice. Start County won. Wow, what a so, game. So that's so, huge. So Delaware puts themselves solely in second place at the moment. So definitely makes things easier going into next week. But... Still need a win. Guarantee right. it. Leave nothing to chance. Yep. That's right. Good stuff, my dude. Coach, great win. What are your thoughts? Yeah, it was great. We, we really were put uh, with our backs to the wall. They got a PK early in the game, but the boys responded well. We put two on them in the first half, and they did what I asked in the second half. The bend don't break mentality, you know, we, we gave him a PK in the second half, but uh, luckily Tanner was able to stop it. Just a phenomenal effort. Puts us one game closer to the playoffs. So talking playoffs, we have one game remaining against Amish. What are your vibes on that? Yeah, we played Amish early in the year. We gave him one, so now we got to get one back. It's as simple as that. Good stuff, man. Well, good luck. Appreciate you. All right, Mr. Morris, you scored two goals in this one. Talk to me. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's a good win. It's a team win, and that's the most important part. We got the win that we needed, and, you know, on to the next one. Most important game of the season. Yep, we're hunting now for the playoffs. One game remaining. What's the vibes? You know, it's pure elation today, and, you know, tomorrow we're back to work. <laughs> and then last thing, talk to me about your second goal, how you scored that one. It's all feeling, man. You just you got to do what you do. Love it, dude. Love it. Congrats, man. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah! Man, between the sticks, dude, you had a massive penalty save. What's the vibe? It's pretty good. I mean, that's second out of three that I've had. Pretty good. I know. For I'll real, take man. It. You're keeping us in games. What were your thoughts on this game overall? Uh, really good. We got an unlucky first start with another PK in this game. Guy just happened to bury it bottom corner. Perfectly fine with it. Um, to then follow up and score not even five minutes later is incredible, and we just kept our foot on the gas. It was great. Good stuff. And then final game of the season next week. What are your thoughts? At home. Get the home crowd there. Heck yeah, We're going to be rolling. Good stuff. Keep it up.
Yeah. Well, holy guacamole, what a game that was. So we did hear that Amish ended up losing their game. We win, so that moves up us up now into the second spot in that playoff spot. So it's up to us now. Win on Saturday against Amish. We're in the playoffs for the second year in a row. Let's do it. Get out of here. Oh, man, that is actually warm. Surprisingly warm water.